Hi, I'm David Dodge for Green Energy Futures. This week, we visit a house factory in Edmonton that's cranking out new, super energy efficient homes at no extra cost. Reza Nasseri is not your typical CEO of a home building company. He's built a one-of-a-kind manufacturing plant that last year cranked out 70% of the most energy efficient homes in Alberta. How does this work? Nasseri himself is an engineer. He got his inspiration for lean process manufacturing from Germany. Well, absolutely. Uh, lean process is something that uh, you know has become uh, 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 very commonplace in manufacturing, uh, uh, saving time, saving materials, uh, saving an environment, and uh, more than important, bring the cost down. This has a lot to do with housing affordability as well. With their house factory, Landmark can build the roof, wall, stairs, and other components to very precise specs indoors. This building process saves materials and about 10 to 12 tons of carbon per house. It also means a much, much more energy efficient home. Kurt Beyer runs the manufacturing side of things at Landmark. It's a precise, computer-controlled experience that's about as far from Joe's swinging hammers as you can get. This is an interior wall being built. This process that we have going here with this building in the plant saves about 6.2 tons of carbon emissions over standard framing practice. That's just in the framing section of what we do. It's not just about framing. The spray foam insulation they use means they get a rock solid seal and extra insulation too. So this is the spray foam section of our production line. The, the big thing about this is the R value that we get is a true R value. When you put fiberglass insulation in and you cut it and you, you push it in, for a friction fit, it's not all that tight. The reason these gentlemen are, are dressed and you can't go past this, whatever foam touches, it clings to forever. And it gives an exact seal, so it gives a vapor seal and an R six and a half per inch, a true R six and a half per inch. The other thing that does, it adds a real stability to the wall. One of the main reasons why we've been able to maintain an average of 83 Energuide energy efficiency rating is because of the spray foam. The industry standard right now achieves perhaps 74 to 76 percent. Landmark uses robots in many ways to ensure the home that's being built is as airtight and energy efficient as possible. This is a very important piece of the puzzle of putting a house together is the window insulation. As you know the North American uh, window reno market is a huge market and the, the biggest reason why it's such a big market is because windows aren't installed properly. At Landmark we make sure that all the backing is put in properly behind the windows, the shingling effect is there, then the window is properly installed on the mullions, properly spaced and nailed. As you can see a machine is lifting this up, placing it into an exact position so that all any and all moisture is wicked outside of the, of the uh, structure. Energy efficiency features such as on-demand hot water heaters, a 96% efficient furnace, triple paned windows, and a drain heat recovery coil are standard features of these homes. Sure, people still want fancy countertops, but everybody gets money saving energy efficiency features. The majority of the people still are concerned about you know, the, the granite and we've got the hardwood floor, which we give them of course. Uh, but. Uh, it's hard to sell uh, the, the energy aspect of it, but we see more and more people actually show interest and they're willing to spend some money on that. We asked Nasseri why it's important to reduce carbon emissions. Oh, because that's the evil uh, that we have to deal with today. You know, the climate, climate uh, change is causing a lot of havoc and we'll continue to do that. Uh, the costs associated with uh, dealing with that, uh, not only in dollars, but in terms of lives, actually, and, and a livelihood is going to be horrendous. In Canada, we use what's called the Energuide to rate the energy efficiency of houses. A new house built to code will have an Energuide rating between 73 and 79. The homes Landmark is producing have an average rating of 83, and by 2015, they're planning for all of their homes to be net zero ready. We have many homes right now with Energuide uh, 83, 84, and by the time we get, uh, we get to 86 to 88, we essentially are net zero ready because uh, uh, with today's uh, solar panel technology, you know, uh, 
uh, we can uh, produce enough uh, solar energy to uh, balance the, uh, the rest of it you know, to, uh, to become net zero. Landmark is definitely moving the bar up on home energy efficiency, and it's the environment and the homeowner's pocketbook that will benefit. To learn more about Landmark's net zero plans and their innovative house factory, and to see photos, our blog, and podcast, head on down to greenenergyfutures.ca. We'd love to hear from you. Check out our Facebook page or send us a tweet or email. Thanks for watching. For Green Energy Futures, I'm David Dodge.